Hi, I'm Mark Williams from Gebret, and this is the ESG Light Pipe Welder. It is a lightweight and compact unit used for joining HDPE pipes, fittings and electrofusion products in a safe and efficient way. The ESG Light can weld HDPE pipes from 40mm up to 160mm. It is suitable for a single plumbing contractor or as a supplementary unit for a commercial business, where the larger ESG3 welder isn't required. Included with the ESG Light is the three metre primary power cable, blue standard welding cable set and instruction manual. The blue welding cable set is also interchangeable with the ESG3. The control panel features illuminated symbols which show the process and operation of the welding cycle. Always keep the instruction manual with the welder. If a weld cycle doesn't complete or there is a suspected malfunction, a reference to potential faults is found in the instruction manual. Prior to welding, correctly prepare the pipe surface. This is described in greater detail in the Gebret Pipe Scraper video. Always check the welding cables for wear and the connection points for dirt. Blow out any debris with compressed air. Do not force a screwdriver or any other foreign object into the connection point. Always check the pins are centered and not bent. Line up the pins with the knurled cable connector in the correct diamond pattern and gently push it in, then tighten the knurled connector by hand. Once plugged in with the power on, the lightning bolt symbol will illuminate. This shows power to the unit. Another tip is to wait until the last moment before removing the coupling from its packaging to keep it clean and dry. Most issues can be prevented by following these simple steps. Measure the depth to the centre of the coupling and place a corresponding witness mark on the pipe. Push the coupling over the pipe until it meets this mark. When connecting the welding cables to the coupling, grip the head of the connector and push straight, making sure it goes all the way in. After connecting the standard blue cable set to the coupling, the triangle symbol will illuminate, indicating the welding procedure is ready to begin. Press the large round button on the control panel to start the weld cycle. This will light up green and slowly pulsate showing that the welding process is underway. This will generally take about 80 seconds. When complete, the tick symbol will illuminate, indicating completion of the cycle and a successful weld. A small yellow tag will now be visible on the Gebert Electrofusion coupling, confirming a successful weld. Once the weld is complete, place a tick on the coupling. Keep the welder in the shade and allow a reasonable time between welds to cool down. Avoid welding in ambient temperatures over 40 degrees. Do not use in damp or wet environments. Turn off when not in use and do not leave unattended during the welding process. For service and repairs, contact your local Reese Plumbing store or call us on 1800 Gebret. For more information, visit us at gebret.com.au.